Hello students, today I am going to discuss with you the modern concept of electron transfer in redox reaction. In my previous video, I told you about the old concept of the redox reaction. In that video, in the last, I gave you a equation HgCl2 SnCl2 G2Cl2 this equation and I also told you that where there is oxidation there is reduction so oxidation and reductions are two sides or the two faces of the same coin if you are asked to justify this statement that where there is a oxidation there is a reduction so justify this statement then how will you justify it? so for this is to justify for the justification of this statement you should select this answer this is this equation this reaction so it is an iconic reaction for the oxidation and reduction or the redox reaction because here in this case when SNS stannous collide is added to the mer uh, mercury collide the Sg mercurous collide and Sn stannic collide will be formed and the color of the solution will change into light gray. So here this is, this is, this is about the reaction but now I, here or on the behalf of the uh, redox it is the, the SnCl2 uh, changed into SnCl4. So SnCl2 uh, it is oxidized into stannous collide is oxidized into oxidized into stannic collide. How can you say that it is it is a reaction of oxidation? Because in my old concept I told you when the addition of negative part in a species then the reaction will be called a oxidation reaction. So here negative part is Cl2 and here is negative part Cl4. So it is a case of, it is an example of oxidation. In the same vice versa, this HgCl2 mercury collide is reduced, is reducted into mercurous collide. So how can you say that this is a, a, a example. This is an example of reduction. So here, in this case, the you, in this case, the positive part, the positive part, or uh, is added into a species. Here, the ratio of the HgCl to one is to two. Here, ratio of the S, Hg and Cl is one to one. So here, addition of the positive part shows us it is a uh, this reaction is a type of reduction reaction so here you can just well. so here in this uh, example both the oxidation and reduction are, uh, are going together together so it it is a justification of the statement that where there is a oxidation, there, uh, uh, there is a reduction. Again, when this reaction is written in this form, in the ionic form, Hg double positive, here Hg double positive, Sn double positive, Hg2 double positive and Sn double positive. Here I have forgot to tell you about this HgCl2 is the structure of HgCl2 is HgCl, HgCl, Hg1 positive, here Hg double positive. So here mercury changed into mercurous. So here in the Hg and Hg there is a bond, metallic bond between Hg and Hg. So always you should write you will never write the mercurous collide as HgCl. HgCl, HgCl, no, it is wrong. Always 
tout mon écolo bien du ciel à combien de dégâts tu m'as fait bon sur le rail always edgy to ciel to all in this way edgy ciel and edgy ciel now here come come here see the ionic form of this reaction is is this so two edgy plus positive the double positive plus sn double positive is equal to edgy double positive and sn four positive here again the stainers oxidized into stannic so it is a case it is a, a example of a oxidation can you tell me that how can you say this is a oxidation in this way this reaction also indicates us that there should be a electron transfer because the, without the losing uh, lo losing the electron the, the double positive can't be changed into double four positive into four positive so it tells us it indicates us about a new concept to think about a new concept of the redox reaction so we uh, we today we are going to study about the modern concept or the new concept of electron transfer in the tissue straight please in my previous video i also uh, mistakenly mistakenly i have written here hg2 one positive so please it is wrong correct that Hg2 double positive like this. So here, as I have mistakenly written Hg2 double positive, so you should correct the Hg2 double positive. Let us come from to the today's topic: the electron transfer in redox reaction. As you know, the redox reactions are of two types. One is oxidation, and that is reduction. Electron transfer. so electron transfer means the some species some ion will lose electron so some ion will again electron so here oxidation when loss of electron or electron is lost by a species that is called oxidation so loss of electron consider it oxidation loss of electron and in the opposite vice versa because uh, the reaction is uh, totally uh, opposite to the oxidation so here gain of electron gain here loss of electron here gain of electron in, in by a species whether it is atom or its ion so here i think that you have understood about the modern concept if the the if any atom or ion loses electron it means it is oxidation if any ion or any atom gains electron that that is a reduction so here in this case to uh, uh, to explain this all loss of electron and gain electron take the example a 2na plus cl2 plus 2nacl2 nacl so justify now you should how will you justify that there is a, a loss of electron or a gain of electron so taking the example of 2nacl2 is equal to 2nacl here according to the old concept when this negative part is added to the positive part so it is a case of oxide so chloride chlorine oxidized to sodium then it is sodium chloride but in view of the chlorine if we take a chlorine whatever is chlorine this with the so positive part is added to chlorine the positive part is added to chlorine so it is a case of reduction in according to the uh, old concept so when so oxidation of sodium here in example here is a ox or sodium get gets oxidized into an acl and reduction of the chlorine chlorine gas change into chloride so it is reduction of chlorine but 
according to the our knowledge that NaCl is an ionic compound the stability of the NaCl is due to the presence of Na positive ion and Cl negative ion all the ionic compounds have they are found in the form of ions positive and negative cations or anions so here so the formation of sodium ion how can it be possible that Na is positive so Na sodium it is neutral sodium atom is neutral and it is changed into the Na positive it can only be possible with the donation or with the losing of the electron so when one electron is lost by sodium so sodium change will be changed into Na positive and this it means the loss of electron sodium lost one electron so it is the loss of electron so loss of electron is called oxidation in the other way this chlor this chlorine atom accept or gainer of the electron so it is, and is changed into the chloride so it is a case of it is an example of reduction so in this way the this reaction can be divided into two parts first part is the uh, uh, loss of electron and in the second part there is a gain of electron so here in the react the part the first half shows us the oxidation reaction and second half shows us the, us the reduction reaction in this way you can explain the redox reaction on the new concept now I am giving you a next example here suppose they are here you can take a next example when Mg reacts with Mg plus F2 reacts with F2 then this is magnesium fluoride magnesium fluoride magnesium double positive like one negative this is an also an ionic compound so here in this case first half first half will be half half mg will lose two electrons mg will lose two electrons and it will change into mg double positive mg double positive and so in the same case fluorine F2 will receive or will, <laughs> will gain two electrons so then it will be changed into two F negative so it is an oxidation oxidation and it is an reduction reduction so in this case in every ionic compound you can explain what are the redox reaction only very simple loss of electron where there is a loss of electron there is oxidation where there is a gain of electron that is reduction so in this both the reaction are vice versa and opposite to each other so this is about the uh, redox reaction now I will get, get right here, here set of reactions and tell you more about the questions of the oxidation or reduction or the redox so this is a set of questions which are generally asked in your examination so the in, re, uh, in the redox reaction generally the questions are asked in an objective form then we have the question the form of the question is select the oxidation reaction so you are, uh, the, there are four options and you have to select only one option so which how will you select the option how will you uh, select or oh, the that it is a, it is a oxidation and it is a reduction so here first i will tell you tell you first i want to tell you about that it is a suppose a, it's, this is a x 
this is x when the when x is may gain minus 1 charge minus 2 minus 3 and minus 4 here it is x minus 4 i think you have you have understood what i am telling you in this same way it is suppose it is m and it is plus 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 these are the charges of an ion so all the ions have their charges some in this in all the ions come in this in, in this area of the charges suppose you here 0 then it is 0 the sodium is 0 and here Cu plus 1 so it is Cu plus 1 when the charges come to this side the increasing of charges of ion and eta the increasing of charges of ion. So consider it is algebraic. The value should be considered in the algebraic. Minus 3 is greater than minus 4. So when you come to this side, it means when in minus 4 changed into minus 3, how can it be possible? How can it be possible then minus 4 changed to minus 3? It means it uh, this x4 will lose one electron one electron will be lost will be lose lost by this x4 so it will be changed into x3 in this way the increasing of the charge here plus one to plus three to plus four so increasing of the charge of iron and atom consider it as a particularly minus three is Minus 2 is greater than minus 3. Minus 1 is greater than minus 2. So 0 is greater than minus 1. So here, and the 1 is greater than 0. So here is the engaging order of the charges of the ion and atom. So when the charge is increased, so consider it oxidation. Vice versa, when you go from this side, this is the decreasing of the charge of an atom, atom or an ion, plus 4 to minus 3, this is decreasing order and 0. Now, minus 1, minus 1 to minus 2, minus 1 is greater, uh, greater than minus 2. So, this is the decrease, when charge is decreased, so it is called a reduction. The increasing or the decreasing of the charge, the decrease here it is by the addition of electron or by addition of electron. This this can plus if you plus here or the addition here the uh, addition of electron the uh, decreasing of the charge of the due to the addition of electron due to the gain of electron here electrons are gaining. Hey, by these uh, atoms or ions or here in this case the electrons are loose here minus one electron here minus electron minus electron minus electron then if minus and then three will be four so according to the if you uh, take this in view that you can solve the all the questions very well so here Cl2 upon Cl2 changed into 2 Cl negative. How can it be possible? So here again you can say here the, the here addition of the electron plus electron addition by the gain of electron two electron this chlorine uh, uh, chlorine uh, uh, gains two electron to Cl minus. So addition of electron, gain of electron will be called the it is a reduction. It is a reduction. Then here again any change into into positive. So it has loss of electron. Loss of electron. So it is oxidation. So it is oxidation. Here 2i 0 loss of electron minus 2 electron minus 2 electron then it get so it is also a case of also example of oxidation Cu plus positive Cu double positive again it is a loss of electron one electron again it is oxidation so here these three cases are a oxidation reaction now here Mn4 this is permanent 
and this is magnet. Note it the name. Power magnet and magnet. Here minus one, minus two. So addition of one electron and gain of one electron. So here it is the case. It is the example of reduction. Here it is reduction. And here F e triple positive to F e double positive. Again, one electron is added to F e. Then it turns into two. So it is also reduction. First, aluminium one two. So minus two electron. Loss of electron. Loss of electron means oxidation. Loss of electron. So is when it must. If you have to write minus electron, then oxidation. If you have to write plus electron, then the reduction. Here minus three and minus four. So what will you write here? You will write here uh, plus one electron. Plus one electron. So it is a gain of electron. Gain of electron plus electron so means reduction. Plus electron means reduction. Plus electron means reduction. Plus electron means reduction. Here to minus two and minus one. Here it means minus one electron. Minus one electron. So it is this. It means MnO4 is losing one electron. So here it is the case of uh, minus losing the oxidation. Oxidation and here it is the case why this is reverse. So I have written this equation reverse to this equation. It is a case of it is an example of reduction and it is an example of oxidation. And what will this is mercurous and this is mercury oxidation. Oxidation is again oxidation. Here think about here only two Hg two double positive only two positive. There are four positive four. Positive, four positive, and here two positive. So it will lose two electron. Loss of two electron. Loss of two electron shows us oxidation. Loss of electron shows us oxidation. So I told you about the redox reaction and how will you select whether this a uh, equation is uh, oxidation or a reduction. With the concept of the gaining or losing the electron, you can easily select. So please, I think that you have understood the modern concept of the redox reaction. So please share my this video to your another uh, to friend, your friends, and like it. Then so my all the my classes, the, the my teaching in the in the this video is. You are feel you, feel you will feel just like you are sitting in a classroom. So please always do watch my video from start to end. Then you will definitely be benefited from my videos and you will learn a more about the chemistry or the fundamental of the chemistry. And last, thank you. That's all. Thank you very much.